In this quick video, I'm going to show you how you can get a Japanese IP address on any device from anywhere in the world. Let's get started. Okay guys, so I'm going to dive straight into this video and show you exactly how to get a Japanese IP address from anywhere in the world. So I've just gone onto the website whatismyipaddress.com just to show you guys where I'm currently located and also the new uh, Japanese IP address that I'll have and just to kind of show you guys that this method is actually working. So as you can see here, uh, this is my current IP address and I'm located in Sydney, Australia. So this means that I do miss out on the Japanese version of Netflix, uh, specific Japanese uh, websites and other Japanese streaming plat platforms uh, that simply are not available in my location. So for whatever the reason you're looking to connect to a Japanese IP address, there's many, many benefits that you can get from doing this. So the best way that I've found on how to accomplish this is by using a VPN service. And simply put, a VPN allows you to uh, take your current location and your current IP address and replace it with a new one in Japan or anywhere else in the world. And you'll also be able to get an extremely fast connection and also a very secure connection as well. So whether you're torrenting or accessing specific websites, using a VPN service will allow you to stay completely anonymous and also get a very fast and secure connection. So the VPN I'm using for this video is one called ExpressVPN. And from my experience, I have found it to be one of the best for uh, providing really fast speeds and also for their really top-notch security as well. And additionally, with ExpressVPN, you do have the ability of connecting up to five devices simultaneously, and they're also compatible with different platforms such as iPhone, Android, uh, Mac OS, PC, and even smart TVs and streaming devices such as the Fire Stick and Google Chromecast. So whether you're looking to stream um, different platforms or accessing different websites, you really do have the um, control of connecting across multiple different devices. So once you do have ExpressVPN installed, essentially all you have to do is click on these three dots and then search for Japan. Now, if I toggle down here, we actually have um, a couple of different locations uh, within Japan that we can connect to, such as Yokohama and Tokyo as well. So if you do want to connect to a particular city, you do have that control as well. Or alternatively, you can just click on Japan and that will automatically connect you to the fastest server on the ExpressVPN network. So that's the one that I typically do. So I'm going to go connect on this one. And this will now go and connect me to the fastest server. So additionally, guys, if you do want to follow along in this video, I'll actually leave an exclusive discount link for ExpressVPN, which is only available for my viewers down below in the video description. So now this is highlighted in green. That just notifies me that my entire device, including all of my browsers, is now connected. So I can go and open up Safari, Mozilla, uh, Google Chrome. It doesn't really matter. My entire device will now be connected to a Japanese IP address. And just to show you guys this, I can now go and refresh the same website. And this will now give me a unique Japanese IP address, as you can see right here. And as for my location, I'm kind of currently located in Tokyo, Japan. So this means I'm now, now able to watch the Japanese version of Netflix, access blocked Japanese websites that are not available from any other countries, and also access additional services such as Japanese banking or any other things that you might not be able to access outside of that location. So again, guys, if you do want to unblock this capability, don't forget to check out my exclusive discount link for ExpressVPN down below in the video description. So as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the next one.